Charlie Lapson here in Hollywood at the GPK Lounge bringing you some red carpet tips. Thanks for stopping and chatting with us. And uh, we're all about fashion, Hollywood and style. You look fantastic today. Tell us about the jacket you're wearing. I'm glad you think so. I got it from, it came from some show, some some job. Okay, this, well, is how I, this is how I get my wardrobe. I take, I steal it. Okay. If I'm stylish, it's usually because Kate dressed me. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Well, yeah. Okay. Mm, I try to keep it simple. Let's talk about uh, the arts and the importance of the arts and keeping the arts alive. I know that you've been speaking with Creative Coalition. Tell me a little bit about what how the arts might be important for you. I told the story in there. I was in I was in high school and I saw Franco Zeffirelli's Romeo and Juliet, um, which is, I think there's one coming out now, and hopefully it'll inspire some young folks. But when I saw that, that's when the Colonel was born in my mind that maybe I could. Maybe that was something I could be, and that appealed to me. It was as much about the experience and the people and the creative process as it was about anything. Making something, putting something together, you know, the team, teamwork aspect of it is very important to me. Could you tell us about one, share one experience that really stands out in your mind for the last character that you portrayed? You know, uh, probably people know me best from Lost. I was in a series called Lost, and it's not an experience, but there's this vision that I still have, and it speaks to that aspect of a family creating something. Sitting under the trees with Jorge Garcia and Navina Andrews, Andrews waiting for them to light a scene or for the sun to get in the right place or for the rain to stop, and playing the guitars and singing songs, having that experience be part of the of the creative process because in fact you learn to love these people or not. You have this familiar interaction with people and um, that's what I remember from, those are the things that stay in my mind. Can I just ask what's next for you? I'm working on a series right now for Fox that's called Gang Related and uh, it's supposed to be on the on Fox sometime uh, after the New Year, I think. And it looks pretty good, because I always look for that, a happy set. Okay. You know, for a happy, creative team that's excited about what they're doing. Everybody's professional, everybody behaves properly, and they're prepared when they come to work. Looks like we might have it on this one, so keep an eye out. All right.